The 8086 microprocessor supports eight types of instructions minus data transfer instructions, arithmetic instructions, bit manipulation instructions, string instructions, program execution transfer instructions, branch processor control instructions, iteration control instructions. Interrupt instructions. These instructions are used to transfer the data from source operand to the destination operand. Following are the list of instructions under this group. Instruction to transfer a word. Move minus used to copy the byte or word from the provided source to the provided destination. Push minus used to put a word at the top of the stack. Pop minus used to get a word from the top of the stack to the provided location. Push a minus used to put all the registers into the stack. Pop a minus used to get words from the stack to all registers. XCHG minus used to exchange the data from two locations. Zlat minus used to translate a byte in L using a table in the memory. Instructions for input and output port transfer. In minus used to read a byte or word from the provided port to the accumulator. Out minus used to send out a byte or word from the accumulator to the provided port. Instructions to transfer the address. Li minus used to load the address of operand into the provided register. LDS minus used to load DS register and other provided register from the memory. Li minus used to load S register and other provided register from the memory. Instructions to transfer flag registers. Lf minus used to load a with the low byte of the flag register. Sif minus used to store a register to the low byte of the flag register. Push minus used to copy the flag register at the top of the stack. Pop minus used to copy a word at the top of the stack to the flag register. These instructions are used to perform arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, etc. Add minus used to add a provided byte to byte slash word to word. ADC minus used to add with carry. Incorporated minus used to increment the provided byte slash word by one. Triple A minus used to adjust ASCII after addition. DAA minus used to adjust the decimal after the addition slash subtraction operation. Sub minus used to subtract the byte from byte slash word from word. SBB minus used to perform subtraction with borrow. DEC minus used to decrement the provided byte slash word by one. NPG minus used to negate each bit of the provided byte slash word and add halves complement. CMP minus used to compare two provided byte slash word. OS minus used to adjust ASCII codes after subtraction. DAS minus used to adjust decimal after subtraction. Moodle minus used to multiply unsigned byte by byte slash word by word. IMO minus used to multiply signed byte by byte slash word by word. UM minus used to adjust ASCII codes after multiplication. DIV minus used to divide the unsigned word by byte or unsigned double word by word. IDIF minus used to divide the signed word by byte or signed double word by word. AAD minus used to adjust ASCII codes after division.
CBW minus used to fill the upper byte of the word with the copies of signed bit of the lower byte. CWD minus used to fill the upper word of the double word with the signed bit of the lower word. These instructions are used to perform operations where data bits are involved, i.e. operations like logical, shift, etc. Not minus used to invert each bit of a byte or word. And minus used for adding each bit in a byte slash word with the corresponding bit in another byte slash word. Or minus used to multiply each bit in a byte slash word with the corresponding bit in another byte slash word. X or minus used to perform exclusive or operation over each bit in a byte slash word with the corresponding bit in another byte slash word. Test minus used to add operands to update flags, without affecting operands. SHL slash SAL minus used to shift bits of a byte slash word towards left and put zeros in LSPs. SHR minus used to shift bits of a byte slash word towards the right and put zeros in MSPs. SAR minus used to shift bits of a byte slash word towards the right and copy the old MSP into the new MSP. Roll minus used to rotate bits of byte slash word towards the left, i.e. MSB to LSB and to carry flag, CF. Roar minus used to rotate bits of byte slash word towards the right, i.e. LSB to MSB and to carry flag, CF. RCR minus used to rotate bits of byte slash word towards the right, i.e. LSB to CF and CF to MSB. RCL minus used to rotate bits of byte slash word towards the left i.e. MSB to CF and CF to LSB. The string is a group of bytes slash words and their memory is always allocated in sequential order. Following is the list of instructions under this group minus. Rep minus used to repeat the given instruction till CX does not equal zero. Rape slash reaps minus used to repeat the given instruction until CX equals zero or zero flag CF equals one. Repn slash repens minus used to repeat the given instruction until CX equals 0 or 0 flag CF equals 1. Move slash movie SB slash movie SW minus used to move the byte slash word from one string to another.
com slash comps b slash comps w minus used to compare two string bytes slash words. INS slash INS B slash INS W minus used as an input string slash byte slash word from the IO port to the provided memory location. UP slash outs B slash outs W minus used as an output string slash byte slash word from the provided memory location to the IO port. SCAS slash SCASP slash SCAS W minus used to scan a string and compare its byte with a byte in L or string word with a word in X. LOT slash LOT SB slash LOT SW minus used to store the string byte into L or string word into X. These instructions are used to control the processor action by setting slash resetting the flag values. STC minus used to set carry flag CF to 1. CLC minus used to clear slash reset carry flag CF to 0. CMC minus used to put complement at the state of carry flag CF. STD minus used to set the direction flag DF to 1. CLD minus used to clear slash reset the direction flag DF to 0. STI minus used to set the interrupt to enable flag to 1, i.e., enable INTR input. CLI minus used to clear the interrupt enable flag to 0, i.e., disable INTR input. These instructions are used to execute the given instructions for a number of times. Following is the list of instructions under this group minus. Loop minus used to loop a group of instructions until the condition satisfies, i.e., cx equals zero. Loop slash loops minus used to loop a group of instructions till it satisfies cf equals one and cx equals zero. Loop and slash loop and minus used to loop a group of instructions till it satisfies cf equals zero and cx equals zero. JCXC minus used to jump to the provided address if cx equals zero. These instructions are used to call the interrupt during program execution. INT minus used to interrupt the program during execution and calling service specified. Into minus used to interrupt the program during execution if of equals one. IRIT minus used to return from interrupt service to the main program.